Hi, my name is Yang Sang Cho, the founder of Jadam and the leader of ultra low cost agriculture method. Welcome to Jadam YouTube channel. As the world is developing rapidly, the use of chemical pesticide and herbicide continues to increase worldwide in agriculture. Because of these phenomena, soil and water pollution is getting worse day by day. Shockingly enough, the scientists are now able to detect chemical pesticide residue inside human body and even in a beer that we love to drink. These heavy use of chemical pesticide is now becoming a serious social issue. Some research shown that the residue is possibly the cause of human depression. Human health is getting worse, and the rise of the farming cost is unstoppable. Because of these phenomena, there is increasing number of farmer bankruptcy and suicide worldwide. Farmer suicide is not only a problem in India anymore. It became serious social problem even in developed countries like UK and USA. Moreover, recently Guardian magazine published an article on US farmer suicide. Why is this accelerating? To see the root cause of this phenomenon, we have to see who controls modern agricultural technology. A few large corporations have full control of agricultural technology. Yes, that's right. Most of modern agricultural technology depends on few large corporations that we all know. Agricultural machinery companies create technologies that need more equipment for farming. And chemical fertilizer companies are spreading technology that need more chemical fertilizers. It is similar that chemical pesticide companies offer technology that uses more chemical pesticides. Ladies and gentlemen, we must look at the current situation in a very calm manner. Modern agriculture technology is not a technology for human health and farmers. This technology exists for the benefits of the corporation. Unfortunately, now farmers have lost control of agricultural technology. Farmers became consumer who relies on purchasing everything needed for farming. Modern agriculture is becoming more expensive. Modern farming makes farmers to farm with more machines, more pesticide, and chemical fertilizers. Eventually, farmers go bankrupt and commit suicide. Furthermore, these commercial agricultural companies are seriously destroying the nature. To solve this issue, both health and cost of farming, I came up with Jadam technology, which I have developed for more than a decade. Before introducing Jadam technology, let me introduce you the great revolutionary Karl Marx, whom I admire the most and inspired me to develop technology like this. He had already prophesied about this phenomenon 200 years ago. He quote, When commercial capital takes dominant position, there's no doubt the looting system works everywhere. He explained that serious damage will occur when commercial monopoly capital dominates this society. Now, almost all areas of the world are in the hands of few commercial monopoly capitals, and agriculture sector is not an exception as well. Sadly, we are used to acknowledging this fact without resistance. We must be independent from monopoly capital that controls the agriculture technology. To do this, we have to create a new path for true farming. The farmer must take their initiative in agriculture technology. It requires fundamental and revolutionary change in the agricultural sector. And I know how reckless the challenge is to take the initiative of the technology that large corporation had. So I planned a bloodless revolution that can be won without fighting to succeed in this reckless challenge. To create a technology like this, there is one more person who inspired me. The great Chinese philosopher Lao Tzu. 2,500 years ago, he quoted, The highest virtue is like water. The water does not quarter each other, but flows down creating a large river and connects into sea. I interpreted this as like the best agricultural technology is like water. The realization of simple and easy organic farming techniques such as water has always been my goal in life. 
When technology changes like water, it easily penetrates everywhere. Only then I believe that organic farming would naturally become popular. To make a technology like water, I have tried my best to make organic farming simpler and easier. As a result of these decades of hard work, today's ultra-low-cost agriculture is now completed. A new agriculture that completely overcomes the technical and costly challenges of organic farming. And that is ultra-low-cost agriculture of Jadam. The key point of this organic farming technique is it can aim high yield without any chemical fertilizers, pesticide, and with minimal use of agriculture machineries. Here are some of the techniques I developed for ultra-low-cost agriculture. This is a direct way to cultivate powerful microorganism solutions that can recover chemically contaminated soil in short time. When cultivating microorganisms, the leaf mold soil are collected near the mountains. Boiled potatoes and sea salt is enough for microorganisms feed. It is simply cultivated without separate heater or air injector. It's a very simple and easy technology. But the effect is excellent. Here's how to make natural fungicide that can reliably control powdery mildew and anthracnose. Full details are uploaded on YouTube. This method can melt sulfur that melts above 120 Celsius degree into liquid sulfur without an external heating. I have invented this method for the first time in the world and published it without patenting it. So anyone can take advantage of this technology. The following is how to make the most important eco-friendly wetting agent for natural pesticide. I have invented very easy technology without heating compared to an existing complex and difficult technology. Combining some of the things that I developed can make an affordable and powerful natural pesticide that can control almost all insects and bacteria. So you may be wondering by now that can farmers get organic certification with Jadam method? An answer is yes. Jadam natural pesticide comply with USDA's organic agriculture regulation. So you can get organic certification anywhere in the world. And Jadam natural pesticide can completely replace chemical pesticide. Farmers can easily manufacture their own inputs and reduce its cost by more than 95%. It can also be mixed with chemical pesticide. So non-organic farmers can also use Jadam natural pesticide with other chemical pesticide. I also did a lot of important research and development for different diseases and pest control apart from the technology mentioned before. With these inventions, I did very special work with the Hawaiian government in 2018. I was requested to solve a problem of coffee berry borer. Then I provided natural pesticide solution which can completely control over coffee berry borer. This breakthrough solution can control 99.9% .9 of coffee berry borer. And I have put all those recipes for CBB control and many other in my book. It is translated into many languages and sold on Amazon around the world. This book and our YouTube channel can help you a lot. We will provide subtitles in 30 different languages for our YouTube audience. Please share and subscribe. This is the Jadam website since 2003. We have about 40,000 members that are registered. If you visit here, you can also see a testimony from farmers and also more detail about Jadam's ultra low cost agriculture. Now, let me briefly talk about the history of Jadam's ultra-low-cost agriculture. My father, Han Gyu Cho, had a lifelong journey to spread organic farming before I completed ultra-low-cost agriculture. He has been doing organic farming movement since 1967. As the founder of Korean Natural Farming, he is very well known worldwide. He made a significant contribution to the development of organic farming in the world. This is the picture taken with trainees at our old farm. The arrow on the left is my father, and the arrow on the center is me. At this time, 
My father's slogan for organic farming movement was Save effort, big yield. I further developed this to complete an ultra low cost agriculture. During his time, he received a great medal from the government for his contribution. Also, he has written several books. Those books are translated and published in many different languages around the world. There are many farmers worldwide who are now following his work as their farming principles. Our whole family have been doing organic farming for third generation. Every year, we grow about 60 kinds of crops at our Jadang farm in Daejeon. Even without chemical fertilizers, we are harvesting more than conventional agriculture. And the quality is also very good. I'm doing all this organic farming by using Jadam natural pesticide. We have been researching and testing various natural pesticides on 60 different kinds of crops. Our powerful natural pesticide can completely replace chemical pesticide. Here is my history before I founded Jadam. I majored in chemistry at Aji University and learned biology and physics. Then I did master's degree in horticulture at Chungnam University and currently studying PhD in plant pathology at Chungbuk University. I found Jadam in 1991. Since then we have 15 staff members and about 70,000 people are using Jadam method in Korea. Our Jadam office is located in Daejeon and we have regular lecture held monthly. My father and my family also have tours around the globe together. In order to support Jadam's ultra low cost agriculture, people make regular donations. Without their donations, Jadam could not exist till now. I want to say thank you for keeping the support. Jadam's technology is not limited to a climate or location. It is also effective against bacteria and pests that occur in the tropics. Our ultimate goal is for farmers to take initiative in agriculture technology. We must independent from commercial monopoly capital dominating agriculture technology. In order to achieve independency, the farmers must take the initiative in agriculture technology. We look forward to a revolutionary change in agriculture with Jadam Ultra Low Cost Organic Farming. Let's open a new paradigm of healthy and prosperous agriculture. Thank you for watching.